Welcome to D and D Night. Hey everybody, hello, and welcome back to Massively Overpowered Television's Dungeons and Dragons Night. And tonight is the namesake Dungeons and Dragons Online. That's right, we are back to our DDO adventures, and sadly, we don't get to do vampires anymore. All of that stuff is uh, now locked away, back behind the expansion. But there's plenty, plenty, plenty for us to do. And today, we're gonna head back to some parlay with some pirates. Because, you know, pirates are fun. So we can spend the whole stream going, Arrgh! That's pretty much what it's all about. So thanks for joining in. If you guys want to kick back, put your feet up, relax, then we're right here to give you some entertainment value. And if not, then maybe we can just make you laugh. <laughs> Aw, is it? Well, boo. Boo, I say, boo. Let's try again. And there we are, on the good ship, D-D-O, where you jump off the edge and who knows where you'll go. Oh, I gotta go back and join my team. There's my team. Hi, team. Are we ready to get me all killed? Eh, waiting for Cat to patch up. I'm gonna get buffs. Look at how on the ball I am. We're just gonna pretend I'm on the ball. I'm on a ship, really. And let's do our roll for today. Ooh, 80. Defense based consumable. Look, I have two slots. It's beautiful. Ah, I forgot to bring up my USBs again. Oh my goodness, this having your house, like, not your house. <laughs> Everything all scattered, helter skelter. Socks! Dug on it. All right. My Larry's here with me. Heading to the harbor. Grab yourself some buffs and come to the harbor. Oh. I'm tired. I would like some magical building abilities. <laughs> Give me some sandbox survival game building abilities right now, please. We can just fix things up. Ooh, party. Doggone it, I keep trying to sprint. Nope, that's not the right place. You can get the sandbox survival abilities in exchange for random puma aggro when I leave my house. Well, pff, that's easy. I don't leave my house. 
Yeah, we've all had a lot of practice now. Wait, no, this is not the right one either. I'm telling you though, those pumas. Ooh. Those things, they were huge. I mean, in so many other games, the big cats are like not that big. These were menacing and they just, jeez. Oh, that fire resistance, I was going to. Forgot where Nadine is. I think I went too far. Or no, I was just there before everybody. Nope, I was standing first. and then you passed me. Oh, well, Darth, yeah, Darth was dancing around. Oh, yeah, I did pass her. Nobody cares about a dancing dwarf. Yeah, I don't want to traumatize myself, okay? <laughs> I don't need more trauma in my life. <sighs> I will never not have a feather fall cloak. Although if another really super uber cloak happens to come, I do have my Featherfall boots to fall back on. Ah, Dirty Vingus. Rival crew, always getting the best of the best. It just means they're better than you. I like how I waved when you said his name, like, yeah, that's me. Yeah. Me, me, here, here. <laughs> All right. Filthy Captain Rackham. Rack him up. The games seem awfully si soft and silent to those of you guys listening in listening land. I think I had it turned down. I don't know if it, I think it might be too low for everybody. I mean, it's actually at a decent level for me, which usually means no one else can hear it. Hey, Max Heyman. Okay. Can't hear the game. Okay, that's what I was worried about. All right, let me head over here and that's as loud as I'm willing to go. There we go. Are we supposed to be going? Where do we want to go? The Legend of Two Toad Tobias. Oh, I remember that guy. Sure. It is September, and I got the okay today to plan a streamathon for this month. So I just gotta pick the day. Pick what kind of uh, 
I'm not sure I'll be able to pick very many physical rewards, especially since I can't find... I can't even find my own stuff right now. I'm not sure I can find any. Those rats were dodging like pumas. Thanks for that reminder, S-King. Tannic comes to your house to give you a hug. Oh, is that going to be one of the tier rewards? I still have New World t-shirts. I don't have as many anymore, but... It would have been fun to give one of those away during a New World stream. I mean, they're packed in a big box of clothes, and, like, literally right now... I have one suitcase of just my most worn t-shirts and stuff. <laughs> And I haven't been worrying about anything else I own. Mayhem, are you one of the people who does the podcast? I do appear on it from time to time, but no, I'm not Bree who does it regularly. Bree is the boss. And her and Justin. The small building stands Ooh. curiously alone in the center of the cove. Yeah, Toaster, I was meaning I could have given it away on one of the other streams, but I didn't quite know where they were packed, so I didn't want to try to do that. Elite? Oh, yeah, we're down here again. Yay! Ooh, music change! Complete genre change. Yaha! We're on the other side of the room, too. Hello, somewhere. Yeah. They're not the ill fates. Holy crud, that music is so loud. I can't hear the guy over the. No, I can't hear any of you over the game. Sorry. Go over here, Sophie. What? Why do we need Sophie over there? Coins. Someone else to take them in. Oh. Oh, grab him. Ah, I went and grab him. Oh. Whatever. Thought we were being nice. No more nice group mates. Ha 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 ha. We wanted to fill his pockets. He's bigger than us, right? I, I have to turn it back down, or the music at least. I gotta get the... Alright, now maybe I can hear something. Ah, she's all about survival! Yeah, pretty much everything I do. Six hundred clay K plat on your main, even after pain. The past barely playing. Oh wow! The yeah. trial will be treacherous. Be aware of every step you take. I'll be watching you. Oh, <laughs> sorry, Max. I'm a different MJ. Although usually it would be this weekend where I am talking with Mark Jacobs. I usually meet up with him at every Dragon Con. There's no Dragon Con. Well, I mean, there's no live Dragon Con. Well, see, I bet he'd talk to you if he wanted to. 
Oh, he is so busy right now. Oh, look, here we go. On the earth. No, that one. Okay. Sorry, I'm checking my wands. Danger. Which door? I said, Ooh, this one? Door? No oh, one. I don't know. Did you open it? No, not. <laughs> I was changing my weapon! So, are you gonna open it? Is it locked? There's the trap. In the door? No. Alright, I'm gonna open the door. Open. You open the no, one. this door. The door that Tannic was talking about over here. Going this way now. Okay, I'm just gonna open this door. It's locked. No one was interested when I went over to it. I think that door was in the lock. Well, I know, but we do have someone who can pick locks. Well, right now, that someone is disabling traps. Okay. I mean, as soon as I heard you and changed my weapon, I came over. This doesn't look good. Alright, let them jump through. This episode was badly written. <laughs> It cannot be picked. Oh. It's probably where you come out. Dude, it's dark in other, here. Other... I only saw the one panel. But I did seem to disable... Wait, wait, wait. wait. Dark. Did Dark just set off all the traps? With the space. I wanted to make sure they weren't going to pop up on this side. Because I think it disabled this side only. It looks like Which we can get through. There's a shiny down there. standing you can get it Woohoo! boy it's dark in here max the pole. age of mmos absolutely i wait is there something over here white pearl and jade over here probably can't reach <laughs> sophie's like yeah watch this oh all right sweet and yet a few coins were too much trouble. I see how it is. That one was a challenge to get it. Hey! I think you guys just locked us out. You have dismantled the rusty iron defenders. This is sure to be the first of many surprises. I was standing in the doorway and the door literally just shoved me out. Boom. Rude. <laughs> Gotta be quick at those door checks. Well, I was waiting for her to hear the all clear from our thiefy thief. After eight. Yeah, she ran left, so I guess left. I guess left. There's a shiny up there. A uh, big fat gold coiny thing. Remnants, yeah. Sorry, I couldn't remember what they were called. Where was the shiny? Up here. Up here. Everybody stand by. Nope, 
you said there was a shiny. That was before we killed the thing that dropped the remnants. Yeah, because I was already up here. I, I, I had climbed a top when everybody else came around. Dart's getting brave going into hallways before they're checked. Yeah, yeah considering we know it's a well now i'm scared to not be in a doorway or be in a doorway <laughs> don't go in swinging yeah i see that, that looks exploding did you make it there's an iron defender right around this corner. I'm scared to shoot off fire because I don't want to blow everyone up. Oh, we can just break this box. Yeah, but there are exploding barrels right in their room. There's more explodies around this corner. Okay. How big could the explosion be? Well, is everyone here? I'll shoot it now. Oh, there's Cat. Okay, wait a second. Let's see if the Iron Defender gets over to us. What was that? Why'd the ground go purple under your feet? What is that purple? That is the Iron Defender spraying oil. Oh. the door. I'm sure I found it because I'm... Does DDO still get content updates? It sure does. What was the last expansion? Sean. with plus five wisdom. I use charisma more than wisdom. <clears throat> oh, she uses wisdom, yeah. Who? Oh, Cleric. Okay. Hold on. There you go. Thieves tools still in there for lurking. Is there anything else to explore down here before we start climbing? An intricate system of ladders leads up the shaft. Agility and physical endurance will be paramount in uh, overcoming that this challenge. Other door at the very, very beginning? I don't know. Um, there's... Uh, there were no turns that we didn't take or anything like that, right? When you guys said go right or left, does it matter? Well, I guess there was the... Yeah, we went the other total direction. 
Oh, yeah. Well, in this wing, though. Not in this wing. There was in the other turn. Okay. Yeah, no, I haven't seen any more. The Feywild expansion. That would be fun. Sorry, it's such a dark one this time, guys. Oh, uh, there's nothing there. Ladder behind us. Oh. No clue how to catch on. <laughs> This is scary without Featherfall items, I bet. You just kind of jump and try to keep walking, just your W key. Yeah, if you're falling and you push up against the ladder, you should grab it. Oh man, this is so trippy! Got a 180 as you fall, yeah. Oh, nope. Stop. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I keep doing that. Now that one actually leads to a shelf. I feel like there might be something there. I'm going to go over. Yeah, I'm looking over here. There's just boxes on this one. <laughs> Darth killed him. Oh. I wondered if this could be a false wall because of how different colored it was. But I can't tell. But it has your typical, you know, Saturday morning, this is the wall that moves. <laughs> uh, which one is the one I need to continue with? This one? This is craziness. Your muscles are worn and weary from the ascent up the agility trial, but you must proceed. Oh, there's a door there. Yeah, Featherfall definitely helps here. <laughs> Is there any reason that we need to do either of those windows or anything? Didn't seem to. Whee! Not selectable or anything. Finally, some light. Shall I clicky? Sure. Oh, you've gotten really soft on me the again, Cat. The stench of sewer fills your nostrils. I feel like ooze is gonna drop on me. Yeah, I don't know why we'd feel that or step on some ooze. I have to have a moment. Those walls definitely look like they're going to pop open at us, don't they? Yeah, and there's a mushroom shiny behind this one, so I know they open it at some point, somehow. Oh, I'm going to wait until everybody comes into this point, because doors might shut. And I know! <laughs> Not that I'm good for anything, I just light stuff on fire. I mean, you want to make sure you've got your healer with you or something. Feels like something where the doors are going to shut and all these walls are going to open before we reach the other side. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, oh. emergency dog catching was needed. Oh, that's okay. 
It's just saying, too bad this wasn't a game where I had one of those skills where I could like grab you and yank you back. <laughs> All right. You ready? There we go. You survived the Warforged ambush. Now the constructs cease to exist. Where was the shiny back here? Shiny up here. Hey, uh, Matt Mead. What was that? The construct ceased to exist. That's a nice way of saying you killed them. <laughs> well, they, they did vanish, so, you know. So it wasn't until we stepped up to this one. Don't pull the lever yet. I'm not touching nothing! Oh. Uh, meat ceiling. What? Does it have spikes? Oh! Probably water down here for a reason. It is pretty. I'm gonna guess that pulling that lever opens up the floor. Most likely. Yeah, it looks like that. So I'll just stand over here. Oh, are you gonna pull the lever? Are we good? I'm good. The floor opens up to reveal an elaborate obstacle course. One wrong step could put an end to the trial. Or we could feather fall all the way down. <laughs> we'll try to do this the right way. So they really mean for you to jump the rest of this way. Well, they must mean for you to be able to catch onto those ladders if you don't have feather fall, but that seems like a precarious jump to make. A series of levers and traps dot the walls, the floor, and the ceiling. Only your wit can solve this conundrum. <laughs> Conundrums! Yay! There's about five traps down here. Yeah. I see the one you gotta solve. <laughs> you see the actual traps? No, I see the puzzles. Oh, I thought you said traps. Sorry, no, I, I meant all the all the puzzles. You try some traps. I know, but what I said afterwards sounded yeah. So the question is, which way do we want them all to face? There's ceiling levers to shoot at too. 
seeing switches, I guess. Yeah. Like seeing something through here. Shiny up here. Yeah. Alright, so if we light that thing up, the thing's gonna start shooting at us. Oh. Hikari up to. I think both of you have gotten soft on me. Or not that you two have gone soft, but there we go. set above us yeah, yeah. you like if you hit okay, that it looks like that shoots over and we just have to start hitting stuff hits that and that yeah it's gonna be trial and error i think here because see you but you hit him right and like i think that one's gonna shoot something that's gonna hit that that's gonna open that one up that's gonna hit that one you know wow Just press things random. Yeah, that's about what we're at. All right, so which one do we want to test first just to see how? I would start with these. Yeah, the first ones. Well, which one though? Well, this was the first one. Let's start yeah, with this one. one. All right, so if we start with the one that MJ's at. Let's see above here, that one and that one. So the one shoots over to the left. Yeah, this one would hit that, would shoot there, which would open that up, which would hit that one, which doesn't do anything, I don't think. Should I give it a go? Oh, it's cold. Let's click one. Yeah, it's lit up there. Yeah. It is lit. Ceiling one lit up above it. Nothing. Yeah. But nothing fired. No. So I, I thought by lighting it up, it was going to fire. That's what I thought too, but maybe no, only if you, only if it hits the lever. Wait. Let me try shooting the lever. See if you can shoot. That yellow one right there next to the <coughs> hmm. I don't know from yellow. Oh, yellow is it's, this I'm one right above it, but me. It's not doing anything. Yeah. Yeah, but I I was asking which one you're shooting at. I can't tell. The one right above the tiles we lit up. The one that's literally above me. Well, that one pushed in that direction, so shooting it wouldn't do anything. Where 
are these levers for? No, no ideas? These ones here? I don't know. No, the ones over in the corner. With the green and red crystals. Oh, I thought we'd have to light up. Let's try to light up the red crystal somehow. Well, at some point, someone's either going to have to suggest something, or I'm going to just pull okay. the levers in the middle and see what happens. Yeah, we're. They, see, these shooters are all green. So these green gems probably need to be. Yeah, I can't tell colors, so that's the kind uh, of thing I need to know. This one, all, almost everything is green, except for this one over here is red. Yeah, and the one mm. on top of the door. Yeah. So all right. I mean, let's them? let's turn one of these. Okay. Okay. What did that do? It just made the two side things up. glow. Did anything above us start shooting? I don't understand. Ah! Ah! Oh! No, not yet. Okay. Oh, only one can be turned on at a time. Okay. Now, can you shoot the target next to the lit green one up on the ceiling? It's not shooting the target. Oh, you mean shoot that, actually shoot that target with the arrow. They all seem pressed back, though. Yeah, as I say, they, they, they seem like they're already pushed. Yeah. Except for this one, well... So this one seems like it's obviously important because it's behind a little gate that has to also be triggered somehow, I'm assuming. So I do this. Yeah, what if we turn this one around? light that one up. Hmm. Asking, all the levers seem switched. Turns out another group of adventure was already here. I forgot to press the reset button. <laughs> yeah, Sophie, I, I see the things, but what I'm, what I'm not seeing is anything above us shooting. I'm not seeing any of it, like, shooting, so I'm not sure where yeah, that's like goes. It's like something isn't turning the shooting mechanisms on yet. Wait, wait, okay, so this lit gem right here lights the gem. There's a gem above me. So then this one here is gonna light Pulling this that one. Oh! Fires a dart high above, I finally fired one. To believe whoops, it is a I just, whoops. Is it because okay. somebody pressed over there, or because I did this one? This one fired a dart. This one directly above fired a dart, which pushed that target. And it also um, changed. Does it also change this crystal from green to red? I guess, yeah. Yeah, if it did. It lit it up. Yep. So now, can we hold that one? I'm gonna pull this one again just to see if it works in both directions. Uh, we need both lights lit up, I guess. Alright, what if 
be like this one. Which did this one fire? The one. Like which which thing fired when I hit this? I couldn't see. All right, so watch the ceiling. We're gonna hit it again. Ready? All right. Ready? All right. Oh. Yep. I guess it was a one time only. I didn't see anything happen. I didn't see anything. The other components in the room return to their initial state. This appears oh. to be a reset mechanism. Okay, so oh. that reset it. Now, this is the lever right above me that actually moved. So when, when, when I turned, this, turned one on. this lever, this switch shot that target. This is the only target that has moved, the one directly above me. You do what you did again. All right, right here. Okay, now it didn't fire this time. It didn't move the switch. Right, because this is what fired it, this lever over here. Okay, so maybe we need to get everything all queued up and then, then fire it yeah. so it all does ricochet across the room. Yep. Uh, we just didn't okay. even know where the firing mechanism was. All right. Over here. Okay, so. Um, if this one went and hit there. Okay, so the glowy things on the floor that you can change the direction of, that I guess is so that when the lever above is hit, it chooses which direction to fire. All right, so we shoot this way, then it decides to shoot this way in this case, right? Then it would shoot from there. So, that should open. Hmm. So can I test something just to see? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, go for it. All right, so I'm going to turn this to make this one lit up above me. I think what's going to happen is it's going to fire over here, then in this direction, then in this direction, then over to the left again. And I'm not sure what that one does. That one might release that gate. So I just want to yeah, see if I think that's probably right. So I'm gonna hit this, watch the ceiling, see if that's what happens. Okay, yeah. but it got here and didn't do anything. It hit here. Except to give more monsters. Yeah, I'm guessing that's gonna happen every time. Well, but, it did uh, hit this one. No, don't go, don't go changing the tiles yet. So it did hit that. It did hit that, and that was where that it ended. That opened the door for the monsters, I guess. Oh, uh, maybe it's this one we need to fire to open that gate. Well, I'm guessing to... Yeah, maybe Wait. this one right here opens the gate instead of the one on the other side. So we need to go for this one to this one, to this one. All right, so aim it in the other direction, yeah. All right, let's try that. All right, this might reset everything on the floor, so get ready to do that again. Okay. Yeah, it did. It seems to just reset the ceiling. Yep, okay, so I'm gonna fire it again. But then nothing happened. Oh, I see. I see it. I see. It. 
This one's going to shoot up here, which is going to turn that one, which is going to fire that oh, one, oh. which will yeah, go yeah, yeah. through the gate. Well, does it go through the gate? Or do we have to get the gate open? Because like Sophie said, it looked like the gate was connected to pipes. So I was trying to see if there was anything else we needed to do for that. Oh, uh, maybe. Well, There's we can try it. over here on the wall by the gate. Yeah, this, 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 uh... This lever right here controls is connected to the pipes. So maybe we need this one first. Yeah, there we go. Wow. Okay, the traps are after the gate. So remember when we do get this gate open finally, there are traps. Don't there. run in, yeah. <laughs> so Darth, you wanna hit that lever and see what it does? If you want me to. <laughs> oh. Uh. Oh. Well, we aren't going through there right now. I guess it's kind of obvious that there are traps there, but. Hmm. We Maybe did... turning everything on is what turns off the traps. Yeah. Alright, did you guys okay, have so it now set? We got it going blah, 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 left. Yeah, to so hit I this one, you're... so that will shoot out into. Yeah, I think if we go up here, then we'll. It, this will shoot up here, which will then open Sophie's pipes. This is two, open the gate. two separate gates, guys. Yeah, I think we have to do them one at a time. I'm not sure. Yeah, they're two separate well, gates. In between, we can't fire without resetting. Um, Alright, I'm gonna reset this. We can try. Let's try it. Alright, is it set up to... MJ, to... get out of there Should in case be. any of this stuff comes out. You ready? Go for it. Alright, that opened the gate. Yeah. Now, is it going to stay that way? That is the question. Nothing to it but to try. Alright, resetting. The gate stay open? Yep. Yes, the gate stayed open. Are they ready to fire? Fire! Fire in the hole! The challenge was no match for you. Yeah! Oh, <laughs> the portcullis rumbles open. I'm still not running through there. I'll wait. Totally <laughs> not a trap. Yet. And we could just bust our way through and get all the loot, right? Might need some of never know. Yeah, long dark hallway doesn't feel trappy at all. Hear a metallic clanking from behind <gasps> on the oh, close yeah. to the <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> when it says you hear something, turning around and facing it right when it gets to you is pretty freaky. <laughs> Anybody want Bracers of Intimidate? Devoted Scepter of Wizardry. Now, should we worry at all about the fire hallway? Well, I mean... Wait, who's sending me stuff? Ah, I don't have room for any of the stuff.
corrosive is. You can give it back. I just. Actually, that one may be good. Scepter of wizardry, though. Oh, I don't know. Are these bind on equipped? To, I mean, bind on. Well, I don't do con I don't do conjuration spells, so or acid, so I'll give that back to uh That came from you, Thursday? Yep. All right, I'm going to keep the other one, the wizardry one though. Thank you. Oh, we're not going to continue this way? Uh, I don't want to try to get through here, but I don't want to die. We're looking at the fire the room of fire. Hey, Kari. Yeah. Are you willing to, uh, like. What if we make the. Uh, I was gonna do it. Oh, he just did. Green. What if we made green light up again? Maybe you can find something to turn off over there. Oh, the farther you go, the more. I can't make that jump. So, do you have any jump boosts? Like a uh, buff? On any of your skills? Oh, whoa, how'd I get up here? Why did I get up there I and then I fall down? No, I just did that, but I was wondering because there is a <gasps> buff skill that people can get. Whoops. This is why I don't do jumping puzzles. I don't think you're going to be able to reach my soul. There is a lever over here. Do I want me to yank it? Yank away. Sure. Nice. You're welcome. I think there's a lot more room over here, too. Sophie's saying this is the other way that we could have gone. Oh! <laughs> we haven't seen a shrine anywhere, have we? No. Not yet, no. Yeah, this is where we came in, and I ran that way where the Red Skull was. Yeah, this is the other direction. Okay, cool. Yeah. And now we know. <laughs> sorry, sorry. That looks like it would have been the quicker route to here. Eh, it still would have got us the same thing. Crap. Now we gotta go find a res shrine. A sweltering wave of heat washes yeah. over your body. Rackham's Inferno will take precision and cunning to overcome. Oh, good gravy. Uh... Yeah, there's a red shrine on the other side. There's a trap uh, box over here. 
Yeah. I wonder if I can just jump over that ledge there. I mean, can't we just get to the red shrine by dropping and going around right here? Maybe. That seems too easy. Well, I mean, we probably have to get back up to to escape over there. Oh, here, over here. Tannic, yeah, there's a... Floor. Yeah. What? There's a what? The uh, uh, plate trigger. on the floor. I know. I just found it. That's why I told Darth to stop. Oh, um, there you are. I didn't see you. For some reason, on my I'm doing my job down here, people. <laughs> on my screen, I thought I saw you run past the fire. No, that was Darth. Yeah, I think we need to be up here in order to cross to the other side of the room that we need. But I think you can jump down to the red shrine. Another box. Go in a chest. It's a real hot one. <laughs> Hopefully, there wasn't anything that could like melt in there. <laughs> Oh, Entropist! Entropist, sorry! <laughs> Just looked at Steam charts for this game. How do they make pennies? Oh, yeah, most people don't play from Steam. Yeah, the game came long before. I just, I play my latest iterations on Steam because I got rid of my original long ago. I don't play it on Steam. Oh. An astute three helm of resistance. Intelligence. It would, pretty sure it doesn't have Steam integration anyway. It would just launch the SSG. Darts, are those for you? Lurking? Yeah, it, it just launches the regular launcher. Yeah. Anybody want resist electricity potions? Helm of resistance? Resist bonus to fortitude reflex and will saves. Who uses darts? Not I. Not I me. do, but I've got more than enough. Give me some anyway. <laughs> There's a switch way over there. Yeah, this see, look I see at least two levers. Yeah, so one, one lever up straight ahead of me is probably the one that clears that one wall of fire to get to the other lever. Gotcha, then. Well, I think you can stand on the very end over there and not get burnt. Uh, the edge close to the red shrine. It has a little, you know, a little, little bit of a cubby. I wonder yeah, if you, you stand in. Probably run it like diagonal. I wonder if uh -huh. you stand in between them if you'll be far enough, because those two look pretty far apart. Um, historically in this game, I don't think that really works too well. 
Yeah, Toaster says, assume there are no safe spaces in between traps. There we go. Oh, she nice. almost got it. Oh, no. I don't think I can res again. We're on Elite. Or I'd go for it. I mean, I... No, he was close enough to the shrine I could res here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's one way to go, except now you're gonna get the dart. You have weathered Rackham's Inferno. A few burns and sweat coat your skin. Wait, what? We still, we all have to make it through. No, how's Darth here? He I took a jump over. potion and diagonally jumped. You rotten dwarf. You don't have to make it across. We opened it. We're done. Oh, I wanted to try. <laughs> well, I have to hit another lever. We're done, right? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. I timed that. I did ballet moves through there, and you just jumped. <laughs> it was impressive, Tanic. It was beautiful. Let's see now. Both switches are off. That's what's important. Stupendous, awesome. Somebody's shooting at us that needs to die. There's more people shooting at us. I can't I see would, any I would kill, kill them first. There. How's that? Danger. Not moving. Not moving. <laughs> Insult to Puma induced injury. <laughs> oh, those Pumas were great. So those elk ran away all those times and the one that turned around and charged me. Roar! Okay, the danger was pointing over here. Face in the ground. Ah, I see. The big red skull there. Danger down there, see? Big red skull. Yeah. Uh, oh, on painted on the wall. You can't. Can you even see the skull painted on the walls? Nope. Yeah, I've been following them some. There's right across from me is a skull. Ah. Is it like a skull and crossbones? Because I kind of see yes. an X. Yep. Yeah. Yes. That the stranger danger stamp. I guess we're going down here. Well, there is a shiny there. This doesn't seem suspicious. Is that gonna be just a big old mimic? <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna try it though. It's really pretty. Just a chance. Sneaking belt of false life. Anyone Maximum hit points, move silently, plus nine. Does that sound Anyone? good looking? Anyone use one-handed long swords? Ooh, mine's only moves silently plus four. I do. There you go, lurking. Uh, one-handed for you, Kit. Or spell casting. That's. Can you use that, Sophie? I got. Great. 
<laughs> Yay! I was able to help. The Thaumaturgic Bastard Sword of Spell Penetration. Spell and Blimp plus seven. It's just a sword I wouldn't want. It. I'm just a sword. I'm just a sword. Toaster says if you switch, hold onto your old belt because death block becomes yeah. important later. That's um... Uh, magical bolts in there for you lurking. Yeah, I'm just trying to think of who can use a bastard sword with spells. Um, a favorite soul, maybe? Maybe. Paladin, yeah, I like guess? Sork Wizard with the Eldritch Knight Advancement. Yeah, is that the exit, or...? Or it's another attack, so keep an eye out behind you. Penzance. First mate of the oh. ill fate motions for you to come over and speak with him. I don't trust him. Part one done. Yo! Made it this far. Next challenge to test your knowledge. Important to talk like a proper buccaneer. Other buccaneers will seem starboard through your facade and kill you on the spot. Convince me you got what it takes. Pirate quiz time, oh boy. Of course! Did anyone get the somewhat inside joke with the name? The Pen's Dance? Yes. <laughs> yeah. This is a pirate of Pen's Dance. I'd be ready to take the pirate challenge. Oh. Much better. Here be your first question. When we plunder an innocent ship, it would be the first thing he oughtn't to do. Bluff, yar. Run, run for the loot as quick as you can. Take a head count of your crew. That doesn't sound very piratey. Run for the loot. I don't have a good bluff, so I'm going to try this. Are we good with that? <laughs> sure. Mighty good answer. Thank you. When arriving in a new port, what does a pirate seek out first? The local tavern, of course. Yar. Prison, so you know where your mates will end up. <laughs> I don't know, actually. <laughs> Probably tavern. I don't know. Everybody vote. Yeah, vote for this one because the prison sounds good too. What's the third option? The prison, so you know where your mates will end up. I built the tavern. Yep. All right. Tavern. I picked up a thing or two along the way. How much share does the captain receive? Double the share of a crewmate. <laughs> are you sure you ain't just already a seafaring sort? Hmm, are you wanting a swashbuckle? Uh, okay, do we want to talk about it? Or do we want to say, sure, we'll fight you? You bet I'd be looking for a swashbuckle. I wonder what the yar is. <laughs> Just bluffing. Bluff. Yar, yar. It's a bluff. I can't bluff. <laughs> I'm saying, I wonder which one that gives us. Like, does yar with a good bluff give us a fight or no? <laughs> well, I mean, I can't stop the talk now. Or remember last time we did this in the oh, middle yeah, of a. No. Oh, yeah. Uh, shall we just. Talking, we're talking 
pirates, of course we should want a swashbuckle, right? That's what I'm thinking. If you want to stop and talk about it, they're not—they're going to see right through us. All right, swashbuckle it is. Anyone disagree? No, go for it. Go for it. Pirates probably should not have been looking for a fight. Treasure oh. bag over there. I thought he said, oh. The treasure bags are individual. Yeah, he said that's the spirit of pirate always be looking for a fight. All right, continue the challenge. I'll speak with the prisoner on the plank. the plank. Please, 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 you must help me. Don't make me walk the plank. My crew needs me and I have a family to feed. Oh, dude, I can't do this. Someone else do it. You're gonna kill a kobold? What's wrong with you? I can't! Someone else do it. Can someone else talk to him or do I have to close it? What happens if you just close the window? Nothing. Someone else do it. I can't. You survive the gruels of Rackham's trial. No. Yeah. Can we survive? I mean... Can we save the... Did we save him? Oh, are we supposed to go down there? No, but we can. Oh. See? Meebo lives! Why'd you let him live? Because... Because I don't like killing kobolds if I don't have to! He just has to find his own way out now. So I guess there's no actual out. You have to... Just yeah, that was the way we were supposed to go back if you wanted to you actually walk to, back. He, he, you need to talk to him again. Talk to who? Yeah. There's nobody there. Oh, Meeple's down here. Oh, he'll let you talk? There's a option. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All I got is walk the plank again because yeah. I think we bugged him by saving him. Wow. Oh, uh, I've got nothing. Yeah, I killed him again. Wait. I saw the door go up again. I guess we killed all the... Yeah, but it's already completed, so... I think you just bugged it because you saved him. Was he supposed to do something else? I mean, Let yeah. What? No! The quest was already done. When I clicked... As soon as I clicked... When they make him walk the plank, the quest was completed. Right, that's what I'm saying. So what's bugged? The fact that he's still there and you can talk to him, oh, I can keep oh, talking to him. And the door else, like the only thing he was gonna be before was puppy chow. Now, see, every time I talk to him, the door is open. That's okay. That means we know he can get out, even though there's solid wall behind that. So we can hey. finish out. Finish out. He's yes. A, he's a ball. He'll figure it out. Oh, crud, I interrupted again. Don't touch anything. Now, Toaster thinks you really can't bluff him all the way to the end of the tree. A small building stands curiously alone in the center of the cove. Hey, we're just recalling again? Yeah, to go turn in. Yep. Oh, crud. I keep thinking I'm just going to turn around and get a screenshot, but no. Yeah, 
Yeah, MK wanted Nebel to die. She just didn't want to do it herself. No. Well, you didn't fight very hard for the other options, I think. The, you know. Well, we wouldn't have finished the... What Hikari's saying. I jumped down to save him from the... I knew the fall wasn't going to hurt him. Boost the ranks of our crew. Plus two unholy battle axe of human bane. <laughs> and I got the Corsair's Galoshes. Part of a three part <clears throat> set. Two of them give you underwater action, and all three give, you know, give you feather falling as well. When two items are equipped, you get... Oh, all three give you Featherfall. Yeah, if you get... I don't know what the other two parts are. I forget. I had them on another character at one point on the other server. Interesting. I did not want Mabel to die. Someone else make him run off, and then I go save him. That's how it worked. Boots, Bandana, and Cutlass? Well, that sounds very piratey. So I made my Carmelitas today, guys. They're downstairs cooling. I'll have to try to remember to take a picture of them before they all get eaten. Woohoo! More pirate fun! He survived anyway. All according to my plan. <laughs> With that, everybody, it is time to head off. Oh, wait, why did I have... Sorry, we have... I didn't have a death. We did have one death, so I guess if it was a party-wide <laughs> death counter today. <laughs> yeah. But that is the end of our adventures for today. I think we might be continuing pirate stuff next time we meet up. But of course... D&D &D night next week is going to be Neverwinter. And you never know what you're doing in Neverwinter until it happens. <laughs> big, big thank you to my wonderful team for coming and being here and doing this with me. And a big thank you to all of you for coming and being a part of this and hanging out with us tonight. Taunting me. <laughs> Some of you have been nice and quiet. Thank you very much. <laughs> Instead of teasing me. I don't want to kill the kobold. If you guys want to rise, rally to my defense, <laughs> there's the stream post link right in chat. If you want to say anything about today's stream or talk about your favorite DDO or D&D &D memories, please put them right there in chat. I can go back and look at them anytime if they're there on the stream post. And of course, thank you so much for supporting us, everybody, with your subs and your Patreon and your views and your your even whitelisting clicking ads. I mean, you don't even have to click them or buy them. You just have to, like, look at them, and that still supports us in so many ways. So thank you so much, everybody. I hope you have a fantastic night. Be sure to stay safe and be well so that we can see you tomorrow where we have more OPTV adventures coming for you. So thanks again. Have a great night. And... We be seeing ya next time, mateys.